Hey guys, I'm back. I'm back! Actually, me and Marshall are back. We're gonna shoot another video. Uh, this one's gonna just be a follow-up to what happened at um, European Motor Works with the case. Uh, last video, I was informed that the previous idiots that did the line bore um, did not do it properly. And when they put a crank in it, they torqued it all up and, and everything, uh, the, they started spinning it and it, it caught. So they were able to successfully install a cam and torque everything down and get the uh, uh, their their cutter. The first number one journal was fine, but the two and three were were off. They were they were they were out of out of round. So they were able to take the cutter off the first journal and the other two cutters they left on. They were able to uh, correct it. So. <laughs> happy day anyways um i finally got my my uh cylinders and those are pretty i finally got my my cylinders and my my pistons so now i can send things off to get coated so let me show you what I've got. Well, okay, first, um, I'm gonna build, I'm building a 2270. I got my, I'm gonna run 40s on it, uh, Weber's. It's gonna be, uh, well, let me take you over there and show you. All right, this is what I have. My case, they were able to uh, straighten it out. So they also installed new pins, dowel pins, and that one's ready to go. Uh, let's see. These are my heads from Lynn Hoffman. I'm running a RAT 9500. This, all this is going to be sent to calico coatings and I'm gonna have them dry film on the bearings and then my pins I'm gonna have them do a, a DLC coating and along with my my uh, uh, rocker shafts so that's that These are my, my beautiful connecting rods. These are just so pretty. So it looks like jewelry to me. Actually, it looks like an old CD disc. All right. There's my crank. So the crank and the cam, I'm sending off to Performance Metals and having them micro polish it. Okay, I decided to go with the one two three ignition just for the simplicity of it it has it comes with uh, bluetooth it's easy to adjust do it by your app on your phone and uh what else oh no oh 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 i'll be right back i gotta go go get it out of the package i know that uh micro polishing and and the the coating is is overkill on this engine 
I would rather spend a little bit of money now than have to rebuild the thing in, you know, 50,000 miles. So I got these from air cooled. They're my Weber's. And I also paid the hundred bucks and had them tune it for my engine. So they're pretty much a bolt on situation, you know, minor adjustments and I should be fine. I'm not gonna have to re, uh, re jet it or anything like that. That's gonna be a pretty thing. I cannot wait to get this thing going. But because of the decisions I've made, uh, I'm not gonna be able to start building this thing for another, I don't know, another month or so. Oh, oh, oh. Let's go over there and, and, and check out my uh, my Nickies. These are my 76 millimeter. Oh, it's just so pretty. I cannot wait. It's gonna be a fun day. After five long years, I might get this thing on the road again. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions, um, comments, um, questions, hit me up. Uh, I will get back to you real quick. Um, Thanks for watching. I hope to start the build real soon. Peace.